Hello, my name is Kanye Clayton. Uh, I am launching my debut collection of poetry. We shed our skin like dynamite. Uh, this is not at all how I envisioned I would be launching my first book, uh, but I'm very, very grateful that this is happening and that you are listening, so thank you very much. I'm gonna read two poems today. They're both about cycles and the comfort even in the destruction and the kind of beautiful inevitability of them. The first poem I'm gonna read is called Family History. Blades shudder against concrete, seeking something soft to butcher. We long to make a lasting mark, trimmed hedges and gently shaped sand a legacy of ice-filled cups and swollen stomachs. The pages of your family written cold and yellowing in a cellar. Who will maintain this mess of skin? Who will shape the glass blades of your past? An old man squats on the sidewalk and tends his shrieking plot with garden shears. Can we work with the weeds? Can we stop fighting natural symmetry, the grooves carved by wind and winter? Sinking proof, the sun rose again, the rising evidence it set. Pick me, pluck me, rake me, arrange me in a vase with water. Bring me inside, ensure my demise. What a beautiful centerpiece I make what a rotting heap of once living sinew. Keep me connected. Dirt to core to dirt again. The roots stretch further in stillness. The next piece I'm going to do is called Home. I actually released this on an album in 2018 called If the River Stood Still in collaboration with Nathaniel LaRochette, who is sitting right next to me over here. <clears throat> home. My feet blackened like catfish on the flat tar roof. Sitting over my own bedroom, dirty toes dangling. Eyes on the road past the mailbox, past the red-breasted robins hearing insects make their way through the soil. Wait wait and plunge into the earth. Same earth of my body. Same earth of her body. Same earth of her ashes poured into lake water. Same earth on my feet. Her body in a bird's belly. Her body dropped on a windshield her body scrubbed off at a gas station. Her body poured into the sidewalk with the soapy water. Her body sinking into the concrete's cracks. Her body sinking. Her body sinking. Her body joining. Her body rising into the air. Her body dispersing. My memories dispersing. Her body, my mind thinning out and joining and disappearing and finding her body again inside me, sitting 10 years old on the flat tar roof, waiting to see her car pulling into the driveway, to see her get out and smile and take me home, take me home, take me home. Please, mommy, take me home. Thank you so much for listening. I hope that you have a really good day and that you stay well. Take care.